Hello and welcome to another edition of UFO Video Addicts. Let me give you a preview of what I got coming up in this video. Uh, the first is a supposed leaked video from the Air Force, came out in 2016, of, um, of them chasing a triangle UFO. Second is a video that came out in 2019 in Saudi Arabia of uh, some strange craft cruising around the buildings in uh, Riyadh. Also have this um, old video from 2011 of a uh, supposedly a UFO that's crossing this uh, Russian jet just before it crashes. I mean, this jet took out a bunch of people. And, um, you know, I guess the implication is that uh, somehow this, whatever this is, maybe caused the, uh, the jet to lose power. Also have this uh, video from Reddit, which shows a strange ring-like UFO. Here's a picture that was supposedly taken over Area 51. Uh, this is a story about this guy here who um, claims to have seen this UFO land. And then, you know, when he went to check it out, it wasn't there. But uh, he does a search, um, you, know, and, you know, after he saw the UFO, he did a search to see if there were any other sightings. And he mentions um, that there were some scientists who previously had um, seen this exact same craft. So I found the, um, the story that uh, he references, you know, UFO sighting in this, uh, basically the same area. And this is from uh, 2006. Uh, let's see. I also have this video, which says from 1938, supposedly shows these archaeologists finding uh, these huge human bones. And, you know, you can see what, what I mean, I, I, I think this is supposed to be the foot bone. Um, and then, you know, they show you what eventually happened to the, supposedly the bones, but I, they're, they're claiming that it, uh, it was created by an artist. Who knows? Uh, let's see. And then last is just this uh, photograph. Um, that, you know, it just shows you the passage of time. I think this is, yeah, this is evidence of time. But anyways, uh, let's go to this first video here. This is a very short video. It's supposedly, you know, leaked video. Again, I, I have no idea if this is true or not. Let me go to the beginning. <laughs> Yeah, again, I don't know how real that is. That kind of seems like a video game to me. But anyways, um, I'll leave a link in the description. Uh, let's see. This is f from Saudi Arabia, and it looks like a, you know, like a UFO that's uh, in trouble maybe. But this guy definitely has some uh, issues trying to get it in focus. Yeah, you see in the title, you know, it says Saudi Arabia invented flying craft. I, I guess this person um, believes that it was something that was created and maybe they were testing it out. Who knows? Uh, link will be in the description. Let me go to this video here. Yeah, now this is an old video. I remember uh, when this happened. Um, yeah, watch this anyways. This thing's going to take out a bunch of people. But you see here, yeah, you know, they're claiming that uh, a UFO passed by this. I think he's implying that um, this UFO probably caused a power failure or something in the plane. But I know, you know, this thing, this video just keeps going over that over and over again. 
but uh, link will be in the description. Let's see. Yeah, this one, I found this on Reddit a couple days ago. Let me go to the beginning. You'll see this. It's First, it's taken from a ring cam. Of them, I guess, of him seeing something strange. I think yeah, you can see. Yeah, here, watch this person looking up. And then there it is. World. Um. <laughs> you know, but I, I believe that something like this could be caused by a chimney or, you know, some type of other um, round or cylindrical tube, you know, blowing out smoke or somehow. I think that's definitely a possibility. But anyways, uh, link will be in the description. Uh, yeah, this is just a photo I found on Reddit. Supposedly of a, you know, of a, this craft taking over Area 51. I don't know, you know, why it's one for four. I couldn't find any other images, though. But uh, link will be in the description. Let's see. Yeah, this is an interesting story about these, um, I don't know if this guy's a hiker or something. You know, but um, he says that him and his buddies were out. Uh, on, you know, on this area, and he looked uh, across here, and he, he saw what he thought was a balloon until it um, moved all the way across here, and then, let's see, he talks, I think it's it's back here where he they, they see it land, so they all run over there to, you know, to check it out, and um, it's not there anymore, so then here he talks about he gets home, and he, you know, d does a search to see if, um, if anyone else had um, seen something similar, and uh, he finds this article or this story, I think it's here. Well, anyways, this is the uh, the story that he uh, references. So apparently, there are a lot of sightings of UFOs around this area. Let me see. If I can find here sightings seen by all 11 members of the expedition, scientific community has been unable to conclusively identify the object. Photograph, the picture taken by the scientists confirmed that there was indeed something and that they were not suffering from high altitude hallucinations. Flight, the object maneuvered on ground and in air to find gravity and wind direction, negotiated terrain, changed color, and took off vertically the most challenging aspect of aviation technology. But I think this is, uh, where is it? Oh yeah, this is the photo. Yeah, you can't really, it's, can't really see the photo of this thing, it's too small, but of course the link will be in the description so you can check it out. But you know, as, as I said before, um, I don't think all of these crafts that we're seeing are uh, visitors, you know, especially if, if this area is um, seeing UFOs on a consistent basis, you know, similar to the Hestelin light, I would have to conclude it must be like a flight path. Uh, let's see, this next video here claims that um, some of these science or archaeologists found these um, bones. You know, I, I, again, if I play this, they're going to hit me with a um, copyright violation. Went to the place, joined research, and bringing to light what we have available. So, anyways, yeah. So here is uh, the, just the photographs, you know, of this guy. I mean, standing on these bones. Uh, let's see. Here's another. Like here's the. I think this is the foot bone. I don't know what that is. And this, I don't know what this is supposed to be. They showed it a few times, but they never actually say what it is. Uh, let's see. Yeah, here's this photograph here. You can see what looks to be a foot. I, guess, I think it's called the metatarsal. Here's another photograph of it. And um, it, they're claiming that this was created by an artist, which I believe is most likely the cover story. But then they say, you know, well, what ended up happening to these bones? And uh, let's see. Let me uh, let's see here. They're, I think they're excavating the bones. 
molds made here molds made according to the 1939 photo oh, photo report also oh, these are from the molds but yeah now you know they're uh, sitting in a museum oh so that was a hand bone anyways uh yeah I, I have no idea you know what to make of this i don't um i don't know the backstory behind it but uh, the link will be in the description and uh, the last is just this uh, photo that I found, um, which, you know, to me, this is, uh, let me see if this image will come up. Yeah. So, yeah, um, this is evidence of time, right? That there's, there's only one way that something like that is created, and that is with the passage of time. I mean, no one can, you know, snap their fingers and make this happen um no one can i mean i guess it could be photoshop but you know that still doesn't take away from the fact that you could go to places and see you know you know pretty much the similar similar thing i think this is called stratigraphy or stratification um so yeah what is it the plate tectonics and things like that you know i know there are books that are written that says um you know that the earth is only five thousand years old but uh, no, no, anyone who tells you that is um, wrong or, you know, yeah, they're mistaken. They're, they're lying to you or they're, they're mistaken because, uh, yeah, the only way, the only way this is created is with the passage of time. Something had to build it up and then something had to tear it down. And the only thing that does that is time. But anyways, um, that is going to be it for this video. If you like things like this, please give this video a thumbs up. Please uh, share this video. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. I'll have more things like this. Take care.